Thank you for joining us. I'm Jeff Wagner. More calls for Minneapolis leaders to defund the city's police department. Protesters have been marching this afternoon asking Mayor Jacob Fry to invest in community led safety measures. And when Mayor Fry showed up, he did not get a warm welcome. David Schumann has been with protesters since they started. He joins us now with the latest. David. There was almost four hours of peaceful protesting, and it's really just starting to wrap up now here at 4th Street and Hennepin Ave. All afternoon, the message was about not only defunding the police department, but abolishing it. Chants railed against racist cops, and songs were sung about putting money into black communities. Then Mayor Jacob Fry was spotted in the crowd and invited up front. Go home, Jacob! Go home! The protest organizer asked him point blank, yes or no, will you commit to defunding the police? She said his re-election bid next year depends on it, and the crowd agreed. When he gave his answer, there was an eruption of boos and those chants for him to go home. We caught him afterward, and here's what he had to say. If you're asking whether I'm for massive structural reform to revise a, stru a structurally racist system, the answer is yes. If you're asking whether I will do everything possible to push back on the inherent inequities that are literally built into the architecture, the answer is yes. If you're asking whether I'm willing to do everything I possibly can throughout the rest of my term to make sure that the police union, the police contract, the arbitration system, and some of these policies that have resulted in problems for specifically for black and brown people, and murder, by the way, over a series of generations, I'm all for that. I'm not for, I'm not for abolishing the entire police department, and I'll be honest about that, too. Throughout the afternoon, the march stopped several times for different reasons. Once it was to have a dance party like they were just having here. Another time it was for a prayer. Congresswoman Ilhan Omar, she spoke at the very beginning. We're going to recap it all for you tonight at 10 o'clock. All right. Thank you, David.